Welcome back to the channel. Sam here with GSK Wealth Builders, and today I'm going to be bringing you another potential helium miner that could be sold and pre-ordered. So I was on the Helium GitHub. That's usually my main source of information as I go directly to Helium's GitHub. And as you can see, there are 10 what's it, Helium improvement projects or something like that. So there's 10 of these on their GitHub website. So when you go down, I went through all of the different companies and actually it was someone in our someone in the telegram group so join the telegram group if you haven't uh, got it that's where i usually spread the information um, before i do a video so someone in the telegram group told me about this miner and i wanted to make sure that they were for real before i did a video on it right so i'm going on the github here and this is the company links dot and they're based in the uk and they do smartphone and wireless technology and this is the miner that they're going to be pitching to helium to be approved so it's just a regular small raspberry pi miner with a nice case on it quad core 1.5 gigahertz cpu 2 gigabyte ram 32 gigabyte emmc not sure what that stands for but bluetooth 5.0 and the typical uh, 1 gigabyte ethernet and 802.11 wi-fi also it has the power over ethernet support so someone did ask me if they wanted to put their miner outside how do they power it and what you could do is you could actually power it through the ethernet cable which is a great uh, great application so that's what the miner looks like with the typical cord now I'm not, or the typical antenna i'm not sure if you can change the antenna there you probably can that would be makes sense so then they're looking at the following timeline so they submit the application in april they want the verification done in May and June, certifications May, June, and then community approval June, onboarding June, pre-orders June, manufacturing and shipping in August. So they're still going to be the same timeline as the, the having, but they have a Discord, Facebook Messenger, and Instagram. So then they have a link to their Twitter and their website. So let me take a look at their Twitter. So IoT manufacturer, 61 followers. So they're fans of helium and they're retreating helium. Obviously they want to get some business. So who knows 61 followers for your company but the picture is nice it looks nice that's all i can say so there's a button here if you go to links dot dot com you can join the wait list you can put your email in there and then you can do explore features so helium long fi wider coverage they say reliable storage power over ethernet and 12 watt energy so the links dot indoor helium miner provides wireless network coverage for internet of things devices using long fi plug the hub to an ethernet connection as it becomes part of the helium networks the world's largest network decentralized network helium then rewards you in hnt cryptocurrency providing you the validating for this wireless links dot uses as little as 12 watts energy and can cover up to 10 miles all you need to do is set up your hotspot from home and start mining join the wireless revolution so they're pitching they're already pitching to join them and and get on their list the antenna is a 4 dbi antenna so that's a pretty powerful antenna compared to what you normally get the Raspberry Pi is typical radio frequencies. So this will determine where it's going to be allowed to be sold. So it looks like they cover China, they cover Europe, they cover Asia with India and Russia. Then they cover India or USA, Canada, Australia, New Zealand, 915 megahertz. So it shows the different megahertz. So if your country is not listed, if you're within one of these megahertz, you can probably use the miner in your location. So I'm good. Uh, in this group here and then you can manage your own 
hotspot through the helium app so they're not doing anything different so how does the links dot compare why should you choose links dot so they're saying their hotspot has been designed so it doesn't look out of place anywhere in your home that's cool it's built with an experienced team of engineers that's relative or subjective and our existing global delivery network is ready to ship so they are pitching that they're going to be able to ship better i'm not sure how they're using there was one miner that i liked they were going to just use amazon or wasn't a miner maybe it was an iot device but they were like yeah we're just going to use amazon so the computing power 1.5 gigahertz cpu and ram you don't really need that much processing power just to put out wi-fi and then they have product updates so they're appending the approval from helium first so first helium has to approve them saying we want you then they got to get approved with the sec with their quality checks and then the helium audit after so you can put your name in there and join the wait list and, and see what happens my my goal is to just get miners faster so if i'm the first on the list of the first order or the you know the first thousand orders in theory you should get your miner faster than being the 125 thousandths order with another manufacturer now when it comes down to quality you're not going to know what the quality is because it hasn't been made before but it's a raspberry pi so it should be simple to make quality oh i like this at the back of the miner they have two holes for pins and so basically you could just put the, the router on the wall on the wall which people are already doing so yeah that makes sense so let's go to coin market cap market's been crazy ethereum's been going up 15% day on Ethereum. Binance up 8%. Dogecoin still up because of Elon, the Doge father. And the market cap is at 2.3 trillion with Bitcoin dominance dropping. I just want to look at Helium. So we'll see what Helium's been doing lately. So 18, solid. Really solid. Um, they have a run up on the last, in the past week. So. Helium is pretty, pretty good, right? They hit 23, was it 19? Yeah, they hit 20 and they dipped all the way down to $13. That was a good dip by there. And they went back up to 18. So Helium, Helium is looking solid. Let's see if there's any other exchanges that they're trading on. Does it not show the exchanges? Oh, there we go. Okay. So you got Binance. Wow, they're added to FTX. I didn't know that. So Binance, you have FTX, and then you have Bixley, Who, Hotbit, and they're not listing crypto.com so i know a lot of americans were saying they're having issues buying binance us doesn't have all of the states they have 42 states that you can buy helium on the other place i would go is bixley hotbit and then ftx ftx was made by an american he does live in hong kong but you'd think you'd go there but crypto.com i'm going to do a video on that crypto.com did add helium as a place to buy so if you just want to buy helium this is where you would go and that's the update there so thanks for you know thanks for supporting the channel i appreciate it please like the video if you got some value out of this and subscribe and turn the notifications on and as always you can follow me at sam gsk on instagram and twitter where i release the information and if you want to know where the or when the news comes out the very first place I'm going to post is obviously my Twitter and my Telegram. So if you're not on the Twitter or Telegram, uh, go in there because that's where I'm going to post the information. Sometimes I can be a few days late with the videos. Thank you very much. Take care.